it's Suzanne. Um, two questions left in the questions that our fans from Wee Wee Blog sent regarding my first Eurovision experience. Let's do this! <laughs> question is, as a member of a virtual team, the Wee Wee Blogs team, were my expectations met when I finally got to meet some of the team members? So there were more than 20 of us together in Lisbon. Unfortunately, everyone couldn't be there. Um, my expectations were not only met, but they were exceeded. The Wee Wee Blogs team is a very diverse team from all over the world and it's a true international delegation of Eurovision fans. These people work so hard. Blogging for Wee Wee Blogs is truly a labor of love. Most of this team has a full-time job and they do this as volunteer work for the fans in their spare time. Every single member of this team is just so passionate and so unique and the different perspectives when pulled together provide the fantastic and unique and overwhelming oh my gosh i love eurovision experience that the wee wee blogs team offers eurovision fans so as far as the team members themselves go gosh not everyone could be present um but i've really had an opportunity to get to know folks online and through social media and not only do i consider my brother family but i consider this entire team our extended family i hope i get to meet other members of the team in the future my expectations were exceeded and uh, this labor of love for the fans, well, it's all about the fans, and um, I love the fan base too, as much as I have grown to love Eurovision. Next question, what did I learn about my brother William and his Eurovision life? Did anything surprise me? So my brother has followed Eurovision. Gosh, the anniversary of Wee Wee Blogs will be 10 years in the upcoming year. So he's followed Eurovision for at least 10 years. And I thought at one point that Wee Wee Blogs was sort of a hobby for him. Um, I knew that he dedicated a lot of time to Wee Wee Blogs, a lot of time to Eurovision, but I had no idea that he runs this like a business. Um, I had no idea the amount of dedication and hard work that has gone into building Wee Wee Blogs over the last 10 years. I was overwhelmed with the amount of respect that he commands in the press room. Um, people would come up to me and say, oh my gosh, you're Will's sister. We watch your videos and your brother works so hard. He is a true gem. He is a true asset in the Eurovision community. I had the opportunity to participate in different interviews and as the the different correspondents were called up to interview various artists often wee wee blogs was the first to be able to go up and you know quite honestly i think this is brilliant on the part of the delegations as they are inviting correspondents up because everything wee wee blogs does is done in real time so they film an interview and i'll tell you 15 minutes later it's highly likely that the fan base is going to get to see it and it's really all about exposure for these artists and i think that wee wee blogs provides a lot of exposure um but my brother just he's bright he's funny he's engaging all of these things about him i knew um but i was just so impressed with what he's built um this was a really unique opportunity for he and I to share in Eurovision. I've tried to get to him to, ex him to explain to me before what Eurovision is, and his response has really been, you just wouldn't understand. And I didn't understand why I just wouldn't understand until I finally got to experience Eurovision. And truly, it's something that you can't understand. Um, until you experience it. But the team that he has pulled together and it is they are amazing and it takes a great leader to build and nurture and grow a team like that. So the level of respect that I have my, for my brother professionally grew immensely. Um, 
he is he's a kind person not only am I proud to call him my brother but um, I'm honored that he's also one of my best friends um, there were some very sweet moments for me um, during Eurovision for instance at one point I had boarded a train before some of the rest of the team and my brother I watched him panic and say oh my god where is my sister um, and then he kind of laughed it off he's like yeah I just didn't have to want to have to come back for you but the reality is my brother was truly concerned that I had been left behind um, we just we had the best time many late nights after leaving the press room having a a late night bite and just chatting and catching up and um, for me learning about Eurovision and learning about this part of his life which is it's an integral part of who he is and um, so I did learn a lot about my brother things that really tied to what I already knew but um, I just I can't tell you how impressed I was and you know he is my baby brother William is seven and a half years younger yes for all of you out there I make a lot of jokes asking who's younger I am indeed the older sibling um, and he was always kind of like a baby to me I read to him when he was a fetus um, he had these adorable little blonde curls and I used to love to play with them and he was always kind of like my little baby and even watching him in that press room there are moments where I still look at him and he's still kind of like my little baby um, although he's all grown up now and I'm just so proud of him and what he's accomplished and what he's built with his entire team and it's taken a lot of teamwork and you know growing up with a little bit of sibling rivalry I think one thing that surprised me was the team environment that he's fostered um, and how much he appreciates and is just truly grateful for his team. So I learned about his Eurovision life and I learned a little more about my brother and for us this was really just a great bonding experience.